Hello English Dev. Want to talk to you today about Bible verse in Jeremiah 17 verse 9 to 10. It says, the heart is deceitful above all things. It's desperately sick. It says, who can understand it? Have you ever thought, why am I feeling this way? Why? Why am I suddenly down or suddenly happy? It says, the heart is a liar, it's deceitful. Then it says, the I, the Lord, searches the heart and tests the mind to give every man according to his ways. So if I read this Bible verse, it says, your heart lies to you. But then it says, God tests our mind. Why? Because we start thinking. And if we think, we can't stop the more we think 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 what if or oh, maybe then worry comes in and then in the heart is the lie from the devil that's why paul said we must be renewed in our mind change the way we think that's why in 1 peter 5 verse 8 says be watchful sober minded sober don't let the devil confuse you not like someone that's drunk can't think straight it says be watchful be sober minded because the devil so like a roaring lion seeking who can I destroy? Who, who will let me confuse their minds? We must not, not let the devil confuse our minds. Make us afraid. Make us believe we cannot go on. It says in Colossians 3 verse 2 it says set your mind on the things above start thinking about the things above change the way you think realize God is in you if God is in you you can do all things in Matthew 7 verse 6 um, Jesus quoted what Jeremiah said. It said, these people, they honor me with their lips, but their hearts is far from me. God is saying, no, I don't want you to just know my word, um, speak my word. I want you to allow my word to come into your heart, fill you with my presence, fill you with the word, like a cup of water. When you fill, fill the water, come out. If we, we're not seeking to stop fear, to stop um, sin, no, we're seeking God first. If we seek God and he comes for us, all the sin will come out, will come out and we will be full of him. But we, we must decide, I will focus like Colossians say, I set my mind on him, not on the world. I want to pray with you. Lord, I pray that we can set, change our minds on you. 
that we know if we allow our minds to start thinking about all the wrong in the world, we allow fear to come into our hearts, we allow the lie of the devil to come out and we pray that you help us, that we have the strength to seek you every day of our lives so that the more we fill ourselves with your word, our minds, our thoughts, we fill our hearts with your word, the devil will flee. I pray that in the name of Jesus. Amen. Bye.